Filmora Creator Academy is always here to help you making your videos better and we are back with another video. Hey creators, this is Deepak from Filmora Creator Academy and today we will learn how to make this one thing, yes, a custom lower third, so stay tuned. Before we proceed, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any Filmora updates in future. So first of all we will need a video, I will take this one video and I will place it on the timeline. Then I need to just keep the project settings, after that we will just cut the video up to the area we want. Okay, so I want this one video up to here and after that we will go to the titles tab. From here just search for lower thirds and you will find so many titles from there. Just take your favorite lower third, I am taking this one because it's looking so relevant with the video. Okay, so I am placing it here like this. Now we will align the video and the text so that they can be properly managed throughout the video and after that just double click on the titles and you can find titles group controller from there. Just change its x and y position and place it on the lower third area. Now we need to customize the text so I will click on the bigger one main text and I will type his name that is Jack Martin and after that the below one text we will put his designation that is CEO of MED. Now for more customization I am adding the company's logo that is looking something like this and I will place it just above the lower third like this. And like this we can resize it and I will put it above the red shape. Now we need to change the duration of the logo and I will change it something like when the text will be shown completely then the logo will appear and the logo will go when the text will start ending. So for that I will just align it something like this. And then we will go to the transition step and I will take a simple transition that is dissolve and I will place it at the starting and at the end of the logo like this. Then we will change the transition duration by holding the corner of the transition and placing it something like this. Ok great, now we need to customize it more and this time we will add the person's face at the lower third and for that we will need an image of that person. So I have this one image that is his DP actually, so I will place it above the logo layer something like this. What about changing this photo to circle, it will look so professional. So for that I will go to the effects tab and I will search for mask and from here you can take this one image mask. Just drag and drop the image mask on the image and the image will look something like this but we want it to be circle. So for that just double click on the image and from here you will find video effects option. Just expand it something like this and from here you have image mask. From here you can take any image but I personally recommend the circle one because it makes the video look more professional. So it's already selected so we just need to make this image a pure circle. For that we will just change the height slider and we will decrease it to somewhat like 74 or 75. Now it's looking a perfect circle. Now we will change its Y position to align it according to the person face. Ok, the masking is done, now change its scale and place it at the desired area. Finally we will give an animation to the DP and before giving the animation just make sure that the DP is aligned to the text and the logo. So just double click on the DP and go to the animation tab, here you will find the preset option and you can see so many presets are there. I like this boom one so I will just double click on the boom one and here it is applied. So now finally let's see how the final video looks. We did it creators. The video is looking so professional and which part of the lower third customization you like the most just comment down below. Do like this video and share it with your other friends. See you in the next one. Goodbye. If you like to recreate this video, you can navigate to Filmora Creator Academy in Filmora Video Editor and click import template at the bottom of the video to get the project files and replace the default media with your clips. If you would like to learn more about video editing, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay updated when we upload a new video on this channel. Do check out our other tutorials on this channel and comment below to let us know what you want to learn next. Till then, stay creative with Filmora.